In our eye on entertainment, James Corden is set to appear at Paley Fest tonight. Oh, that's exciting. CBS 2 Entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez is live in Hollywood with more. Suzanne. <laughs> And Pat and Rick, can we just talk about, I'm inside the Dolby Theater. This is where the Oscars happen. This is the lobby, of course. And uh, this is where all the big events happen, including Paley Fest with James Corden, who's killing late night, just hosted the Grammys. He's on a roll, and you know he has something special planned for fans tonight here at the Dolby. Every morning, just the same. Since the morning that we came to this poor provincial town, come on, Don't you just love his Crosswalk Theater Company productions? Corden will be joined by executive producers of The Late Late Show and Emmy Award winning actor Bradley Whitford will be moderating. We hear there might be a little karaoke happening with the audience. His carpool karaoke segments are a viral smash. In fact, his segment with Adele was last year's most watched video on YouTube. Lindsay Lohan is planning her return to Hollywood. The actress has been scrutinized for her social media posts and hopes to poke fun and have some fun with a new prank show called The Anti-Social Network. The Mean Girl star will take control of contestants' social media accounts, then challenge them to do embarrassing things for prizes. She's currently shopping the show with several different networks. And speaking of networks, CBS Daytime landed a record 70 nominations, including every show in CBS's daytime lineup has a nomination. The nominations were announced on the talk this afternoon with them being revealed live during the and they got eight nods, the show did, the most in the show's history. And another reason to celebrate, Sharon Osbourne returned after back surgery put her out of commission. She says being back is the best medicine. The Young and the Restless is the most nominated daytime show with 25 nominations. And of course, we'll find out the winner Sunday, April 30th. Now, Pat, I know you're a huge daytime fan. Yeah. And obviously, you're a guest co-host on the talk <laughs> frequently. And I learned you have 22 Emmys oh. under your belt. So, to me, you were their secret weapon. Oh, <laughs> that was so sweet of you to say, Suzanne. And you know what? I probably wouldn't get a it's dime incredible. from on, on eBay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay. I'll pay. <laughs> oh, you're kind. But very nice to have, nonetheless. A big thank you for everybody.